Shall I compare thee to a summer's day? Thou art more lovely and more temperate. Rough winds do shake the darling buds of May, And summer's lease hath all too short a date. Some time too hot the eye of heaven shines, And often is his gold complexion dimmed, And every fair from fair some time declines, By chance or nature's changing course untrimmed. But thy eternal summer shall not fade, nor lose possession of that fair thou owest, nor shall death brag thou wanderest in his shade, when in eternal lines to time thou growest, so long as men can breathe, or eyes can see, so long list this, and this gives life to thee. Will in Shakespeare's famous sonnet 18, Shall I Compare Thee to a Summer's Day? The importance of the performance to me is so huge. And, you know, the understanding, the, you know, the difference of the language, you can't, you can't modernize it, it would be pointless. It is what it is. But the understanding of that passage, what is, what is Shakespeare saying? Well, he's saying, if I were to compare you to something as lovely as a wonderful warm summer's day, you'd win. Because you're more beautiful and more temperate. What do we mean by temperate? Well, more even, more regular, more reliable, more comfortable. Rough winds do shake the darling buds of May. So sometimes, even in, in May, you've got this lovely blossoming of summer beginning, and then there are horrible strong winds. Well, you, you don't have that, and summer only lasts all summer long. That's too short. And even, there are some days when it's too hot. And sometimes, the eye of heaven or the sun fails to shine. And everything that is beautiful, every fair from fair some time declines, everything that is beautiful has an off day, a bad hair day or whatever, by some chance thing happening or nature's changing course, untrimmed, unhalted, unpaused, the march of time, you no longer look as beautiful as you once did. But not so for this person who's the recipient of Sonnet 18. Your eternal Salma will never fade, nor lose possession of the beauty that you own. <laughs> never will death brag that you are his. And when in t eternal lines to time thou growest, when you get into that point of moving on into eternity, so long as men can breathe or eyes can see, that needs no translation, forever, so long is this, and this gives life to thee. It's just awesome, and so often, I think, completely misunderstood and read very badly. <laughs>